What am I going to do? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I'm going to stay up all day. I'm going to sleep up all night. I'm going to give it a ho, hey, ho. And I'm going to stop worrying about calories. It's Brittany, bitch. And I am back in the form of a new company, the Michael Scott Paper Company. Okay. It's not gonna make this one. Oh, long term, definitely. Fall in love, have baby, spend every second together. But don't tell him that, okay? Just tell him I'm like up for anything. I mean, I'm not a slut, but who knows? I would like to introduce you to Mr. Danny Cordray. He is going to be joining us as our new traveling salesman. Say hello to Danny. Me. Okay, you know what? No, no. Creed? Yes, sir. Everything okay? Everything's cool, dude. I'm 30. Well, in November, I'll be 30. Michael, is that scotch? Scotch and Splenda. Tastes like Splenda, gets drunk like scotch. Clinky, clinky, clink, come on. Come on, come on. You should order the most expensive thing on the menu, so he knows you're worth it. If you do that, you're going to have to put out. Oh, yeah, you'll have to put out. What do you mean you have plans tonight? I have my daughter tonight. We're renting Charlotte's Web. Well, you have to make a choice. It's either your daughter or me. My daughter. Okay. I see how it is. Oops. That was cold. Empty. Mine too. Oh boy. Oh okay. Okay then. I really love your outfit. Thank you so much for saying that. I can't believe that Toby thinks this is inappropriate. Oh, you look great. You look like J-Lo. Oh, thank you. That is so kind. <laughs> yes, it's too tight. Way too tight. Really? This is why I'm here? Why is it so tight? What's the European cut? This is no get-together. This is a party. Cafe Disco, we're like crappy disco. You're bad. Love at first sight. Actually, it was no. It was when I heard her voice. It was love at first see with my ears. Oh, okay. That doesn't work like that. Well, I'm not a romantic. White <laughs> Sharoot, man. How's Sharoot Farms? Good. This guy owns his own beet farm. Insane. Well, it's weevil season, but we were prepared. Weevils. What a crazy word, man. I don't even know what that means. What does that mean? They lay their eggs inside the unripe beetroot. Then come springtime, the babies eat their way out. Crazy! That's too much for me, man. I'm gonna hit the bathroom. You've already been several times. Yeah? Maybe you have some kind of bladder infection. I don't know, maybe. I'll order you some cranberry juice. It's vodka, you're the best.
You're shaking. Are you all right? Just leave me alone! I'm on the third day of my cleanse diet. All I have to do is drink maple syrup, lemon juice, cayenne pepper, and water for all three meals. Um, I just bought some bikinis online, size two, so... I look amazing. Sometimes I'll start a sentence, and I don't even know where it's going. I just hope I find it along the way. Like an improv conversation. An improvisation. This is gonna sound sort of high maintenance, but could we have it like three degrees cooler in here? I always think better when it's cooler. You know what, Pam? Make a note. I want us all to start having pina coladas every day at three. Well, you can't today, we're doing inventory. Inventory's at the end of December. We couldn't do it without you, so we postponed. <sighs> I specifically went on vacation so I would miss it. Hey, bra, I've been meaning to ask you, can we get some Red Bull for these things? Sometimes the guy's gotta ride the bull, am I right? Later, skater. I just want you to know that I will be mean to Jessica if you want me to be. Oh, no, no, it's fine, Kelly. It's really no problem, I was already planning on being mean to her. Yo, game on. On it. Jessica, did you just fart? And that is how it's done. <laughs> I think those might be empty. No, no, because the ice melts, and then it's like second drink. <laughs> second drink? <laughs> Funny how we can be surrounded by people and still feel so lonely. Hi. Hi. How is everything? How's your car? It's great, you know, reliable, great mileage. Is that so? How about this weekend we take that sucker to a duck pond or something? Maybe get caught in the rain? Well, I can't. I'm going skiing with Jessica. You know, a couple of dopes on the slopes. Oh, like a goodbye trip. No? Oh, oh, that must have been so fun. It was fun. We had a good time. Hey, have I told you you look really nice today? Oh, thank you. Yeah, is that a new tie? Um, no, not, no, no, I got it at TJ Maxx, $4. That is amazing! You think that's good? Check out these pants, $9. What? $9, the boys department. No. Look at the ass. Check out the ass. No way! Look at that. Way. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> you guys like apples? What? Do you like apples? Uh, sorry. Well, well how do you like these apples? All right. On a scale of one to ten, how hot is that dude? Is he your boyfriend or something? No. But he could be yours if you play your cards right. Jim, check that out. What is it? That is vodka, and I mixed it with orange juice. I call it an orange vod juice cup. Wow, that is delicious. Yeah. I can't believe no one's thought of it. I know! <laughs> This needs to be shared. Beyonce, pink the color, pink the person, hot dogs, basically anything that is awesome, snow cones. Hey, Michael wanted me to ask you how to raise your desk chair. It's the lever on the side. That's what I told him. Thanks. Oh my god, he is so cute. Would you talk to him for me and see if he likes me? No, I don't think I can. Oh, please, Jim. Please, please, Jim. Please, please, please. He's so cute. I like him so much, and I would do it, but I'm too shy. Please, Jim. Please, please, please. Please, Jim. Please, please, please. This puts us at threat level midnight. Accounting, you are on customer service duty today. That's really not our job. Midnight, but... Oscar. Don't worry. Kelly will be training you first. Kelly's training us? This day is bananas, B-A-N-A-N-A-S. This day is bananas, B-A-N-A. -A I don't have a headache. I'm just preparing. <laughs> I have so many people to thank for this award. <laughs> okay, first off, my kids. 
because yes. I couldn't have done it without them. Thank you. Let's give Michael a round of applause for emceeing tonight because this is a lot harder than it looks. And also because of Dwight, too. Um, so finally, I want to thank God because God gave me this Dundee. And I feel God in this chilies tonight. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I want you to tell me that you care about me. That is what I want. Kelly, I'm your boss now, OK? You can't keep talking to me like I'm your boyfriend. Oh, big, strong man, fancy, new, whatever. I don't think you ever cared about me. I never cared about you? Six months ago, Karen Filippelli sent me an email, asked me out. I said no because I was committed to our relationship. Well, I hope you're still committed because I'm pregnant. <laughs>